back. It is now week six of eight. We are definitely making progress in this class. Uh, I also have some good news for you. Uh, we no longer have any new supplemental set of standards or metrics to consider in addition to the others. Uh, we have four supplemental sets of standards, the GRI, the SASB, the UN standards, and the task force um, focusing on climate change. And those are the four major ones. Uh, we use these sets of standards to pull out specific metrics that are important to us. And we must present these metrics in some kind of integrated manner to assess how well or how poorly our organization is doing in regards to the field of sustainability. Where do we go for a process or a framework to help us understand how to present this information in an integrated manner? Well, fortunately, we have an integrated reporting framework and we'll be looking at that this week. Uh, our personalities of the week uh, on the screen right now, Aaron Burr, former Vice President of the United States, assassinating Alexander Hamilton, former Secretary of the Treasury of the United States in a duel. These two gentlemen were actually not only political rivals, they were also business rivals. Uh, Alexander Hamilton founded the Bank of New York and had many very important monopolies in regards to banking services. Burr managed to start a rival bank uh, that still survives today, Chase Bank, which operates right here in Texas, was originally founded by Aaron Burr. Interestingly, however, Burr could not simply found Chase Bank as a rival bank to the Bank of New York at the time. Burr was only allowed to found Chase Bank by claiming that his bank would finance a sustainability venture that Hamilton would not finance. Burr's Chase Bank pledged to finance methods of bringing fresh water to the city of New York. And it was based on that environmental project pledge to bring fresh water to New Yorkers that persuaded the government of New York State to give Burr the banking contract or license. Burr founded Chase. Burr then challenged Hamilton as rival banks. And of course, that challenge preceded their personal and sadly fatal challenge uh, that you see on the screen right now. So please keep in mind, as you start to integrate the various metrics and standards that you've been learning about throughout the class, that there are many different factors that must be integrated to understand the field of sustainability, such as business and political, and I would argue personal factors that you see playing out on the screen in front of you. With that, please go ahead, enjoy module six, and I'll see you right back here next week for module seventh, the next to last week of the course.